channel name subscribe and click on the notification bell so that you can be alert anytime i drop new video hello guys you are welcome back to this youtube channel and um good enough this is the third way of removing your background from your picture on autodesk sketchbook application oh you've got to love this method all right um so the first one we'll be going with is on this selection uh possibly you might have seen me using it before so clicking on this selection too uh, there are many things for you guys to see there all right uh, we have our magic wand all right and under it we have rectangle we have olasco i'm still going to teach you how to use all of that we have magic wand uh we have tolerance and we have you know this shape now if you are the type that used um color draw you understand that it is used to match two um two objects together for example if you draw a rectangle and another rectangle if you use these two the both will be matched together and cut out all right you may not understand but with time you are going to understand we have a replace all right to replace it and we have remove like i'm saying the other time if you place two if you place another shape on that rectangle and you click on this effect it will cut out do you understand now so <clears throat> we are I, I put it on hard hope you can see what i'm doing and um, we have um we may not be able to use this for now when we get to all these our um uh lasco and rectangle we'll be able to use all of that do you understand so this is the effect we are using now so before you can use it on this particular picture you've got to sketch or listen to me please listen to me please don't forward this video listen firstly it's either you've got to sketch now this is a new layer all right let's imagine now you sketch all of this um don't worry uh tutorials on how to sketch are still coming more so uh don't bother yourself that i'm just you know doing it anyhow so just let's imagine this is our sketch all right and then just sketch it anyhow somehow and the head detailing also is sketched all right so i just want to try my best to be very fast with this all right so just sketch it all around the hairs and the eyes just make sure you do a rough sketch for it is that okay and then you can go with this way how oh, just let me hide this you take your color directly the color you want to use on the picture be like blue and use it to highlight the picture all around remember on a new layer can you see on a new layer good so you use it to highlight the picture around and you know this is what you still end up doing if you sketch just that it will be more neat all right oh yeah so this is what we are doing if you sketch likewise this is what we are still going to resort to so i just want to use one color for everything just because of our time all right i want to use one color you can you know you separate the color of clothes and hair and um, skin eyes mouth i mean the lips the feet the eyes and everything you separate them they cannot be on one layer it's not possible unless you've done them and then you decide to to merge it good so now just let me use my field to to quickly fill in this this work now to use my selection imagine now you see the sketch is now on heat do you understand so the sketch is just to close the mouth of your of your work do you understand it now so on this color now i want to use my selection tool so i click on this selection and uh, click on this add do you understand so just click on the color you want to select uh, let me see what's going on here oh sorry um, I've, I've dismantled it the other time all right let's see oh yeah come to this other school here can you see now so it's now selecting good so you click on this yeah like i'm saying the other time look at this arrow now this arrow can now move what you just done can you see it it can move it around it can move it around good it's now back to the position and uh, you can click on this invert selection 
now you now come back to the picture you want to remove the background all right uh, then you can increase the size of this and put it on transparent mode with this all right then you begin to erase it remember it's a rough uh, sketch and a rough example i'm just giving all right so of this now can you see we have a picture at we have it out we have it out good so with this also it cannot lose quality you see it's just in a gif we are done with that so just make sure you make your sketch very beautiful do you see that now so you can import any kind of image you want on the background and it will be there now all these areas showing white are areas that the colors likewise cover so that's one of the reasons why you also need your sketch so if you want to do your own, just make sure you make it neat and I tell you it will remove it perfectly and very fast. Just turn your tool, your pencil to eraser mode and begin to erase. I tell you perfectly well, it will do that for you. Do you understand that guys? So thanks you for watching. Once again, please and please share this YouTube link for your friends to see and like this video. Recommend this YouTube channel. There are many more tutorials coming. Thanks you guys for watching. Bye.